Hi friends! For this video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys a decluttering and organization of my closet. Let me give you guys a heads up, a big warning. This is going to be a disaster. I have a whole bunch of junk stuff everywhere, or at least we would stuff just everything, just about everything that didn't have a place in the bathroom. We would stuff it in our closet. But for this video, I will be sharing with you guys a decluttering. I'm going to be taking everything out and I'm also going to be organizing. So stick around that way you get more motivated to cleaning and organizing your closet. Welcome back to my channel friends. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. I appreciate all the love and the support that I get from you guys. For those of you that are new, hello my name is Delia Mireya. On my channel you will find all kinds of organization, cleaning, beauty and lifestyle videos so please do subscribe if you are interested in those videos i really hope that this video that i'm sharing with you guys today inspires you on cleaning your home that it motivates you that it gets you up and cleaning but wait till the end of this video because in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys where i bought the organizers that i purchased how i'm going to be organizing everything to get started for cleaning this closet in the bathroom or the linen closet. I'm going to be taking everything out. Every time I clean my home, any area that I'm cleaning, I like to take everything out if I have the time because this takes a lot of time out of your day. You're going to take everything out. That's what I did. Then I'm going to be grabbing just a rag, a microfiber cloth, and then a cleaner, and then I'm going to clean everything just to dust everything and to get rid of any spills that might be inside the closet. Once I took everything out, I realized and looked at everything. I'm like, wait a minute, I have way too much stuff. Does that ever happen to you guys when you're cleaning any area in your home and you take everything out and you're like, wait a minute, where did all this stuff come from? Everything just starts piling up throughout the years. Way too many things. I have way too many perfumes, way too many body sprays, lotions, a whole bunch of stuff. A lot of this stuff is actually things that have been gifted to me. First of all, I'm going to be clearing things that need to be thrown away, things that are expired. I'm going to put them in a trash bag I like extra boxes that I need to throw away I will be throwing that stuff away then I'm going to keep a couple of perfumes only I will be giving some of them away as well to friends and family just because I don't want to have too many things I'm in the process of actually decluttering my whole house I'm starting little by little I'm not a minimalist yet I do want to keep that in practice I don't want to have too many things it made me so happy that I was able to collect a lot of things to give away and not only did it make me happy but it also made my family happy because I gifted a lot of these things to friends and family in Mexico and I was happy that they actually loved the stuff that I gave them once I cleaned everything in there in the cabinets so I have to decide what goes back inside, what I'm going to be donating. I know there's a couple maybe body sprays or lotions that I really haven't used at all. So those I could probably put in a donate or giveaway pile to friends and family. Other things like empty bottles of deodorant or my husband's body sprays, which I don't know why he accumulates so many and he just leaves them in there. So those I'm going to pour in what's left into possibly only one container. I purchased these organizers from Walmart. I am going to be using these. Like this box of razors. I'll just empty them out and put them on my container. In this clear bin or organizer that I purchased from Marshalls, I'm going to be putting all of our toothpaste, extra toothbrushes, floss i'm going to be putting our cotton swabs everything that has to do with mouth everything for personal hygiene i'm going to be putting it here and later on i will be sharing with you guys how i made some labels on my cricut joy it can be overwhelming when you're cleaning like this when you see a mess and you see things everywhere what I would suggest is that you start piling everything in categories for example all of the perfumes colognes put a pile for that all of the 
lotions or anything for your face put it in a different pile deodorants a different pile as well this will make everything so much easier i also had a box or a clear bin that i purchased from marshall's that you will see a little bit later on i put all of our first aid stuff in there bandages thermometers gloves everything for that now you will be seeing a way that i cleaned my closet but then later on I actually decided to switch one of the bins, the gray ones that I use for my personal stuff. I actually switched them for clear bins that I purchased from Marshalls. You will be seeing that later on. Friends, I'd like to share something with you guys. I am the type of girl where if something is new to me, sometimes it can be frustrating. I purchased my Cricut Joy and at first I thought that it was going to be a bit difficult for me to use it. Let me be honest with you guys and tell you guys that it's not difficult at all. Your first, Once you um, purchase your Cricut Joy, you're going to download the app on your phone. Then you're going to use Bluetooth because that's the way it connects to your phone. Then you're going to open up your app and the labels are already pre-made. All you have to do is add any label to, you're going to add any names to your labels. Now, after that, you're going to insert the smart label writable vinyl. You can use the mat if you'd like, or you can use it without a mat, which your Cricut Joy comes with a mat already. You're going to insert it in and the instructions are so easy. It tells you step by step what to do. The labels, as I mentioned, are already made. All you have to do is put the names on what you want the labels to say. I put toothbrush, first aid, bath essentials, and face masks because that's the ones I'm going to be sticking on to my organizers that I have in my bathroom. It's so easy and I am not getting paid for this. I purchased this with my own money. I thought it was going to be a bit uh, difficult for me to use and sometimes I get frustrated when it's the first time that I use something and I can't understand how to use it but I will say in all honesty that this is a very simple to do. After so many videos that I've watched I still thought it was going to be difficult and it really isn't. The app tells you step by step what to do. You don't even need to watch a video because the app tells you what. To do and when to do it. Now this is how I organized my closet the first time and then I actually made some changes. I added the Lazy Susan, the turnable, the turnable wheel just because it's so... Now this is how my closet looks like after and I made a couple of changes. I added a Lazy Susan and my husband liked it this way more because he's able to just turn the wheel and he's able to see what's right behind. 
and he doesn't have to dig through the whole men like things men like simplicity they like to find things right away and they don't like looking so he really likes the wheel and he says that he would have liked his stuff to have been organized in wheel but i'll probably do that later on i like the organizer bins that i purchased from walmart i like the way they look and i feel like this is a better way for him to keep his things organized that way he knows he needs to put them back in the organizer and it really has been and it really has stayed that way since i filmed this video thank you guys so much for watching this video thank you guys for taking the time out of your day to watch my video i really do appreciate each and every one of you thank you guys so much i really hope that this video motivates you guys to decluttering and cleaning your kit your your bathroom or any place in your home may god bless you all and i will see you guys in the next video bye bye